Well, first up this morning, a brand new musical has made its world debut right here in Seattle at the Fifth Avenue Theater. It's a completely new story set in the world of National Lampoon's vacation franchise and now a performance from the Griswolds Broadway Vacation. How can I do this? I've screwed up once again. My life's a vicious circle like a drive around Big Ben. I need my family. I'll come through in the clutch. Sometimes I just cry cause I love them all so much. This is a crisis. If I can't score some ticks, my whole life will be worthless. I'll be worse off than the Knicks. Place her some tickets for my kids and for my wife. I refuse to lose the only thing I'm proud of in my life. We are the Griswolds. We can leave Target with just what we're needing. We are the Griswolds. We discuss things that are gross while we're eating. All alone, I'm a sad little note. Together we make up a symphony. some other stuff I haven't told them yet. I need to focus. Things didn't go as planned, but we're the Rolling Stones and I'm not breaking up the band. We are the Griswolds. We play Monopoly for 16 hours. We are the Griswolds. You see our Christmas lights from Willis Tower. All alone I'm a splatter of paint. Together a work of Picasso's art, just less weird. Yes, we are the Griswolds, and I am facing my worst fear. Back home, my life is a bust. Just want to give them great memories, just like my dad did for us. Yes, I've had screw-ups, but never on the scale. I've got until tomorrow to prove I don't just fail. I'll steal them or buy them, I just have to find them. But I'll scour this town, cause we are the Griswolds. Yes, we are the Griswolds. Goodness, I don't think I realized until I heard you sing that song how well suited the Griswolds franchise is for a musical. Yeah, I think so. I think yeah. it should have been done years ago. It is hilarious. You can leave Target with only what they came in for. Yeah, I know, which is never true. That is not true, but it is for the Griswolds. <laughs> yes. Thank you so much, Hunter Foster. Yes. Thank you for being here. Of course. Um, you played Clark Griswold, an iconic character. What has that been like? Oh my God. I mean, I grew up with these films and, you know, I watch The Christmas Vacation every year and I know I know all the lines by heart. <laughs> and, to, and Chevy Chase has always been one of my, you know, icons. And just to be able to, I pinch myself every single day the fact that I yeah. can actually play this part. And I grew up, you know, my mother was a big fan of, of these films. I used to call my dad Clark all the time. Oh, <laughs> so, I love that. And my wife calls me Clark. So, you know, there you go. So it's, this worked perfectly. Yeah, I, yes, it worked perfectly. Well, it seems like it was all meant to be. You're also a Tony nominee. That is awesome. Yes, yes. Yes, yes, Tony, uh, Little Shop of Horrors, so, uh, the revival. Oh, yes. that's cool. Who yeah. did you play? I was Seymour. Of course you yes. were Seymour. So uh, what can people expect when they come to the show? Say they've never even seen, you know, unfortunately, if they'd never seen a Griswold movie, what can they expect? Well, what's interesting about this as opposed to other movies that have been musicalized, mm -hmm. this is a completely brand new story. So the Griswolds obviously have been to Wally World, they've been mm -hmm. to Europe, and they've been to Vegas. And now this, this is a brand new story in which they're actually going to New York yeah. and going to see a Broadway show. So it's a completely brand new story, which I, I think is interesting. I love that because it's like a, it's kind of, it's very meta. You're going to see the theater about seeing the theater. Yeah, absolutely. 
I think it's so fun that we have stories like this that really encompass the whole family and really remind us of that, don't you? Oh my God. I mean, I think John Hughes, who was, I think the, the story comes from him, mm -hmm. and it was about his family trips growing up. And I, I remember being in a station wagon <laughs> with my family and my <laughs> yes. sister. And, you know, I think everyone can relate to that. And they, they totally know what it's like to take family trips, whether it's in a car, on a plane, or whatever. And it's, it's just great for families and members. And it's a great relationship with, uh, obviously, me and my wife Ellen and with the kids as well so I love it yeah. so how do you how do you prepare when you're on the road when you're we're doing a show like this how to prepare I mean you know it's it's a constant you, you have to it's a physical thing so being on stage for two hours it's a physical thing so you have to warm up your voice warm up your yeah. body make sure that you're hydrated make sure that you're in good physical condition so it's it's like I they I compared to being an athlete in a lot of ways, because right. you really have to be, and mentally you have to be focused for two hours, which is a really difficult it's, thing sometimes. It's really hard. It's, yes. it's like, I've always liked being, performing in any way to being like at a party where you're on for like two hours straight and you're just talking to everyone. Yeah, that's right. I'm sure everyone is wondering what this shirt says, and I love it. Can we can we get the shirt if we come see the show? Yes, you can. There's lots of merchandise, lots, lots of great merchandise in this shirt. We are the Griswolds. You know, I wish we had had the um, hockey jersey from the Christmas movie, oh. where she has the Blackhawks with the Griswolds on the That back. would be amazing. Yeah. All right, yeah. we'll, we'll work on that we'll with the merch department. Well, thank you so much for being here. This has been an amazing honor uh, to hear you sing this morning, and thanks to your pianist. Also, you can go see the show you've got until October 2nd to catch the Griswolds Broadway vacation, and it's happening only at the Fifth Avenue Theater, so make sure you get your tickets.